Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka The Venom Blog. And today, I actually still don't have a ton of movie news. Uh, it's been a really slow week. I think Scott Hayes, I saw on Instagram that he was hanging out in Hawaii with like James Franco and his brother for his birthday. So happy birthday to Scott Hayes. I think his birthday, I, I don't know, I, I'll, I'll put it right here at the bottom. I think it was December 30th, but if I'm wrong, I'll, I'll put it right there in the bottom. Uh, but he was hanging out in Hawaii having a good time. And I guess they're just taking like a week, maybe two off from shooting, going on a little hiatus, or maybe he's done with his scenes and they're, you know, just wrapping up the rest of the actors that are in the movie. I think the film is, uh, they're only, principal photography is only going on for another two or three weeks, I think, in Atlanta. So it's like, uh, like mid to like, you know, towards late January, like 20, I think 6th was the official uh, last day, but sometimes things wrap early, sometimes a little late. Uh, but that's the plan right now, I think, is the 26th of January. So not a ton of news right now. Um, Atlanta Filming is doing a bunch of other stuff. So I've been following their Twitter uh, and Marvelous Realm, but they've been, you know, pumping up for other Marvel movies that are being made down in Atlanta that they're filming right now. So they're kind of hands on deck, uh, all hands on deck on uh, on those projects and seeing like actors and people show up and coming back from Christmas. But there hasn't really been a ton of Venom news. But what I did find today was actually pretty cool uh, since this show, although I have been lax, if you saw like the intro, you'll probably see that I've actually gained, a, a, I think, a pound, two pounds back. Um, um, I would drop to 201, and before I could even make that video, like, uh, put it in a video, I was like, oh, I'll wait for the next video, I'll put 201, and then, like, two, three days went by, and I put up the next video, and I was already back to, like, 203, and then 204, um, so, um, yeah, I, I just, I haven't kept up with my workouts, uh, and so reading this is like, oh, maybe this is perfect timing, this will get me back into doing the push-ups and the sit-ups, I kind of cut back on those for a while because my work schedule has just been so intense. Um, and then also food, as I've been at work, I've just been eating, you know, mall food basically, and it's it hasn't helped. So now I'm back in, I, pr pr you know, cooking, preparing some meals to bring with me to work for the rest of the week. So I should be back on schedule uh, starting tomorrow, actually. Uh, although I did do some push-ups and sit-ups today. So I saw over here the Cheat Sheet. It's a health and fitness website. So again, great that the i don't know if sony's intending to do this but they're definitely putting that spin on the marketing where they're like hey reach out to people you know on youtube like there's these guys called uh, buff dudes and they uh, i'll talk about them in a second but they have like a fun youtube channel i'll put the link down below and i'll put a link to this uh, this article i'm reading down below as well this is from uh chelsea leary and she's writing for health and fitness and and like i said it's neat to see that uh, because eddie brock is someone who works out and who you know that's kind of like a part of his personality in the comic books that they're actually going that route with some of the movie promotion uh, and it looks like Either they or someone reached out to this uh, this website, or maybe this Chelsea took it upon herself to write this article. But it's basically uh, the title of it is "The Insane Way Tom Hardy Is Getting in Shape for Spider-Man Spinoff Movie Venom." And basically, what this is uh, this is covering is Tom Hardy's weekly regimen, essentially. Um, so she lists that he's you know he's training five days a week, sometimes even twice a day to to stay in the shape he needs. A lot of people were asking me like, "Hey, why is he working out? Why is he doing MMA fighting?" Why is he doing this stuff? Like Eddie Brock is not a martial artist. He's just a guy who works out and, and just lifts and gets built. Um, why why all this? And it's like, yeah, but when you're making a movie, especially when you're Tom Hardy too, like a lot of some actors like to do a lot of their own stunts. Tom is, you know, definitely no exception. He does have a stunt person. He does ha he does have someone stepping in when like, you know, the studio's worried that, you know, something could go wrong or he could get hurt. So, um, you know, it's just obviously to protect, you know, their actor, their their main asset here. And uh and but he has to run, he has to, you know, all these things you you need cardio, you need to do all this stuff. Um it's funny a lot of people are like oh why did you know like why is uh, Stephen Amell so in shape for Arrow like he doesn't have to lift those you know pull himself up in that pull bar in every episode anymore why does he keep doing it it's like yeah but he still has to run and you know same with everyone in that show same with everyone in movies like especially when you're playing superheroes or supervillains or anti-heroes um you have to you have to be in really good shape so she also mentions he's going through intense MMA training, uh, which we just talked about. He's doing combo and defense movements, uh, things like that. Um, his He has had previous MMA experience with movies like um, Warrior. And he also trained really well for Bronson when he made the movie Bronson. Uh, so I think she mentioned that in here. Uh, the Buff Dudes Workout, uh, they basically found out what Tom Hardy's regimen was, like what he's doing every day and every week to get in shape for uh, the character of Venom. So these guys, uh, and like I said, I'll put a link to this specific video, especially down below, but these guys do the workout. They're like, all right, we heard, we got a list of like what Tom is doing to stay in shape uh, for the Venom movie, and we're going to do it. And again, it's like really, 
interesting ways to market this and, and pulling in a different audience, you know, because I feel like people who do work out and who do, you know, um, get in really good shape for health or just for, you know, just building mass, whatever their reason is, um, that's a whole audience that uh, does go and see these movies. And they and the superheroes are always in, like, incredible shape like these people are. So it's it's neat to me that they, you know, reached out to these people or they reached or these guys reached out to Sony, whoever worked it out. But I, I like seeing stuff like this. It's just it's it's interesting. It's maybe not as uh, mass reaching as something like the Deadpool marketing, but it's still it's 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 the grassroots. You know, it feels like very grassroots marketing for a movie and uh, and, and finding an audience and, and finding someone who. Um, outside of the original audience and, and just going around like you know and and, uh, and getting as many people to go see this movie as possible because obviously the goal is to make money but uh, at the end of the day it sounds like this has become kind of a passion project for Tom it seems like he's getting really into playing Eddie Brock and getting really into the role um, and then his uh, she mentions that his workout increases um, intensity every so often so it's like five days a week and then boom, he just starts, you know, going hardcore after that. And then, uh, or if he's like, D today I'm doing 20 uh, reps, uh, he may do 50 reps. You know, it's like he he intensifies quickly uh, to keep it going. And then uh, and then towards the end of his, you know, week or, or routine, he s slows it down. And so she kind of breaks it down. So again, I'm going to put uh, the Cheat Sheets link to their um, this article and their Facebook page. I'm not on Facebook, but if you want to give them a follow on Facebook, check it out. Uh, Chelsea Leary, this was a really interesting article for someone like me to read who is trying to, um, trying to get in shape, uh, trying to lose weight before this movie comes out. I'm using this movie as inspiration to drop 20 pounds. Uh, we dropped seven and then I gained back uh two and a half well three technically but i'm back down to 203 now so um so yeah so we're we're keeping it in there we're trying to get down to 188 and i think we can do it before the movie comes out so this is all i have for you guys right now but i thought this was pretty interesting and again kind of keeps in the health and fitness of what this show is doing on top of uh, giving movie news uh, but hopefully in the next couple days or next week we will have more uh, Venom movie news for you guys. And, I, and as soon as we do, I will share it, I promise. And as far as like the other stuff I've been posting, I've been posting a lot of streams lately. Um, uh, Batman Arkham City just went up. Um, also, like some of the Transformer stuff. These Some of these are just old uh, streams I found that people have been wanting me to post. So I'm just doing it now while I while I don't have a lot of, like, of my own content that I'm making because of work, like my hours. Uh, and then also I've been sick recently. So i'm just trying to get a bunch of stuff up there uh and uh batman though we did record just the other night on uh, new year's day so that is new and that'll kick off like this year of twitch streams with a new banner and logo you'll see it all on the thumbnail i'm sure uh but i just want to again thank you all this is the first video of 2018 i'm really excited and we can only go up from here there's going to be a lot of news coming for this movie i'm sure very soon so stay tuned thanks for watching my show as always like share subscribe all that fun stuff and i'll see you in the future peace